Hey everybody, I'm Louis Skeeble from Power Mods. You know, sometimes we break our pull start recoil cord, it just snaps, especially on these older sleds, you know, they get worn out and they always seem to break when we really don't want them to. So if you break your recoil, there is a way to start your sled and I'm gonna show you how to do it with your handy little toolkit here. So in your toolkit, you're gonna find this little plastic clip here and that goes on your clutch. You're gonna find a little length of rope and all you're gonna do is thread this through here. Just tie on the little knot on the end of it. That's it. On the other end of the rope, just make yourself a little loop. That's going to be your handle. Okay? All you're going to do is you're going to take a little notch here, and on this side of the sheave, you're just going to stick it in there. Wrap your cord around. And there's a little channel right here that you're going to lock your pull start cord in. Just get it around. There you go. Install my little handle. And I always wear my gloves when I do this. Don't wrap it, the cord around your fingers or your hand or something because you know what if this starts and that little clip doesn't let go it could suck everything in and you don't want that to happen. Make sure your kill switch is engaged. Make sure everything is ready to fire right up. Now Obviously you can't pull from the side, you've got to have a straight pull on this. I usually just pull it straight up. Got to keep my hand on the throttle here. So there you go. You know that if you break your recoil, the rope goes flying in there. You do have a way to get your sled started. Just make sure that this is in the toolkit and that you have your toolkit in the sled because over the years they just seem to sort of go missing. So thanks for watching Power Mods, I'm Louis Skibo. Make sure you check us out on Facebook. Check out firstplaceparts.com as well. They have all kinds of parts for your sled as well as clothing and all kinds of cool stuff. Thanks for watching.